Hey guys, this is here. Welcome back to another video. And today I'm gonna be doing a Minecraft tutorial. And as you can see, you can see my face, obviously. <laughs> so, uh, as I said in the last video that I did, I got a webcam. Uh, and yeah, I decided, you know what, I'll put it to use. And I decided for this video, let's just do something simple. Let's, uh, you know, I'm just gonna do. A tutorial. Don't know what I'm gonna do for tutorial. And I got somewhat of a rough idea of what I will be doing for tutorial. I'm gonna be showing you in this video how to get emeralds very, very quickly. This works on both uh, versions of the game, Minecraft and Java. It should, anyway. I don't see any way that there that it shouldn't work on Bedrock. Uh, but anyway, let's get straight into the tutorial. So anyway, uh, I'm not going to be going on bird flop for this video. I'm going to be going on my personal survival world. It's called the Obsidian Republic. And, oh, oh, T TPS is F or FPS. Yeah. Okay, let's see. So, uh, as you can see, so, uh, as you can see, I have an abundance of trees. I have way more trees than I should, and it's starting to turn into sort of a bad habit, really. I don't really need this many trees, but I have them anyway. Uh, oh. Oh, right. Come on. Let me get my... Yeah, while well, I'm here, I should actually... Alright, so anyway, uh, for this, uh, I'm going to suggest, so what you need to do, just get, just find, um, some saplings, you know, just get some saplings, cut down some trees nearby, and what you're going to want to do, oh, jeez, keep forgetting, I don't have feather falling, I need, I need feather falling, come on. Uh, let me just go sleep real quick and then I'll actually start the tutorial. Yeah. Also, as you can s also as you can see, I have a bunch of pumpkin soldier things. I don't know why I have these, but uh. Yeah, I just think they look cool, personally. And, uh, before we say, Oh my god, Nick, you wasted a bunch of iron making these statues. No, I didn't. I have a, uh, an armor smith that, that I can just buy stuff from. See, right here. Chest plate, uh, chest plate, eight emeralds. Leggings. Six emeralds. All right. Alright, anyway, so what you're going to want to do is you're going to get some, uh, some saplings, you know, just, uh, just a decent amount, and, uh, what you need to do is I would suggest, so let me just go and find somewhat of a flat area, uh, I think, uh, maybe four saplings would be alright, so space them out by one, two, three, four, five, and then like that. One, two, three, four, five. And also, for this to work, you, you definitely need to be next to a village. Because how the heck are you going to get all those emeralds if you're not near a village? Seriously. But anyway, uh, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to wait for those to grow. And I would suggest expanding this at some point. As you can see, I have way more trees than that. I probably have at least 32 saplings. Like, trees, I, I have to have at least 32. Uh, but anyway, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to wait for these to grow. And then as you get more saplings, you know, expand it more. Space it out by five blocks. It must be five blocks. Otherwise, it, it won't grow properly. And then you get, like, a nice little a gap in between all the trees. And anyway, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to find... Uh, once you get to the village... If there is not a Fletcher at your village, uh, don't worry, I will show you how to, to make a fletching table. 
Uh, I believe I have some gravel somewhere. Oh, yeah, I have some flint, some gravel. Uh, anyway, okay, hold on. Uh, let me just, uh... Alright, so hold on. Let me see. So, uh, I'm just gonna try to get some gravel. Uh, some flint. Oh, there we go. There we go. Uh, so anyway, what you wanna do to make, uh... The fletching table is you want to take four oak planks and then two flint like that. And then uh, I already have a fletcher uh, over here in this house. So uh, let me just see if he'll come outside. So anyway, he's this guy with the sort of the sort of Robin Hood hat. This is this is him right here. This is him. And anyway, he trades sticks for emeralds. And if you and if you're thinking to yourself, why do I need a tree farm? Well, you see, the logs turn into planks, and the planks turn into sticks, and then, boom, you 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 got yourself an emerald. Look, okay. Uh, and, um, over time, as your tree farm gets bigger, what you can do is you can get a weapon smith to sell you axes, so then you can have an infinite supply of axes. I have an infinite supply of stone axes, so I can just buy a bunch of stone axes. I know they're kind of... I, I know stone axes aren't good, but he sells them one emerald per axe. One emerald! That's extremely cheap! That's extremely cheap, even though it's a like a stone axe. And anyway, uh, let me just show you how many emeralds I've gotten from this trick so far. Uh, let me just add this. So, as you can see, I have 39 emerald blocks. And just to show you how many emeralds this is, uh... I can make myself a, a, a nice little a nice little hut I can make myself a nice little hut see that that's hard work And, I mean, in the long run, this definitely pays off if you want to get a lot of emeralds. And if you don't want to, if you just want to get a little bit of emeralds for now, uh, just, just, uh, just a little bit of emeralds, you know, you can, oh, oh no, <laughs> I fell in the water. Uh, what you can do is you can just, you know, make a, a tree farm, uh, and then once you have enough emeralds, just cut down all the trees, you don't, don't replant them, and just, you know, uh, and, and just, you know, get rid of the tree farm. And what you can do with the, uh, the extra saplings is if you have, uh, is if you have, uh, a, some extra, you know, saplings, uh, what you can do is you can take the saplings and turn them into a compost and put them in a composter and then you get bone meal beautiful beautiful bone meal and this and bone meal is very very versatile and I know that the amount of saplings that you're gonna get probably won't get you a great amount of bone meal but uh, in the long run you should have a decent amount of bone meal I thought I had some in here but uh, apparently not Anyway, guys, I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, please do like and subscribe. Hit the bell so I always get notified of when I post a new video right next to the subscribe button. Uh, that's where the bell button is. And also, I'm just curious uh, if if you guys want to see me do, you know, like a survival series on here. Uh, this was just, you know, just to do a demonstration of, uh, you know, tutorial. Just to show a tutorial. And, anyway. And, um... Yeah, if you do want me to uh, make a survival series on here, uh, let's get this video to three likes. If I, this video gets to three likes, 
I will start making content on here. And anyway, I will see you in the next video. Bye.